I have a very special last minute quest that I need to embark on today. Uh, I read on the news yesterday that my favorite carousel, the 1910 Denzel Luff carousel in Seaside Heights, New Jersey is going to be either temporarily closing or closing for good. I can't really figure it out because every article I've read says something different, but the last rides available are this weekend. So I'm heading down there to see if I can snag a ride on this historic carousel before it goes into hiding for who knows how long. So won't you come with me and see what we can see? Sounds good. So it's kind of funny because I've, I've been going to Seaside since I was a little kid and when I was in high school, they used to pass around these, like, you know you're from New Jersey when articles. And the first one on the list was always, you've known the way down the shore since you were six years old. And I realized that I'm absolutely driving this with no GPS, no map. I know the way like the back of my hand. I've lived here for so long and it's just, it's just so dang important. So... The, the carousel means a lot to me and it means a lot to a lot of people. Like I was talking to a bunch of my friends yesterday and they're like, I used to ride this all the time. And even, you know, when, when I was older, I went with like my, well, one, my one friend was like, I went with my first wife and I have a lot of really good memories about that. And I'm scared. I'm really scared that this is going to end up one of those situations where they put it away for safekeeping and then, you know, it gets hit by a fire and they have to, they get to, oh no, we get to claim the insurance money. This is a historic carousel. You know, it's, it's over a hundred years old. And just to see, I don't know, it got, apparently, according to the articles I was reading, uh, the article said that it got sold to the township of Seaside Heights and Seaside Heights are the ones managing all this. So, I don't know. We'll see. I'm just getting off the parkway now. I showed you a little bit of it before. Uh, I managed to jury-rig my setup so that I can kind of film in the car right now. But I don't have a real good camera. I'm still filming with my phone. But I'm going to go. And then when we get there, we'll hopefully... I think it's in the coin castle. I want to say that the carousel itself is in the coin castle. So... See you guys in a little bit. Riding over the bridge. Takes us into Seaside proper. It's pretty funny that they're actually taking it out because they've made it such a part of their identity. Like, this is what you see when you first pull onto the island. Like, welcome to Seaside Heights with a big old carousel horse in the middle. You can tell I'm here early enough in the season because I actually got parking on the main street. Um, but I do have to pay for it. So this is Casino Pier. Um, can you see it? I don't know if you can see it. Whatever. We'll find it. We'll go inside and I'll show you guys around. It's a little different from the last time I was here. Those used to be like... Oh, I heard the carousel bell. Okay, we're going in. Can you guys hear it? Open the doors. Yeah, baby. Hey look, there's people here for once. You can kind of see in the middle there, uh, they've actually removed the band organ that's been ready to be restored first. Oh, now we got people waving too. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get a token to ride, so. It is $2 per credit and they actually do them on cards now, not um, tokens like I remember. So I guess it's been a little while, oops. Um, but yeah, so they we're actually in a casino arcade, they call them down here, um, because they've got casino machines, they've got, oh, they got skee-ball over there, that's what I'm going to hit up in a bit. Um, super stoked, but that's not what we're here for right now. I made an improper footwear decision for getting on the horse today, but that's okay. We did it. And I have another ride, too, if I want it. So this is this is so special. I'm gonna cry. You should keep track of like all the videos that I cry in at this point because it's like forever. So this is a little weird. 
interesting to not have the band organ and just like a recording, but let's see if I can read when, it, when we get across to the, uh, this hand carved Denzel Luft carousel was built circa 1910. There we go, cry. The ride comes to an end. I don't know, a little bittersweet. Oh, you can't see like any of my face. There we go. Do I go one more time? I think I should. Maybe I should ride the Tiger, one of the outside stationary ones. That's what I'd do if it was a carousel with brass ring, but the only one I know of is a Knoebel, so we're definitely not there. You can see the inside of the carousel right now, actually. That's pretty sweet. The Floyd L. Moreland carousel. This was, oh, it was restored the year I was born. As far as I can tell, Dr. Moreland is actually still the one who is in charge of restoration, so that'd be, that'd be really cool. And he does work at the City University of New York still. down the shore without going and getting some marukas for lunch. So I'm gonna grab me a slice. Maybe I'll do a mushroom slice. That's usually my go-to here. But it's a beautiful day. Walking past tours, walking past the beach itself. We're on the boards. Um, the boards are still relatively fresh so my improper footwear decision has not been that bad of a choice today. I'm a little toasty though. It's getting a lot warmer than I expected. And it's also a little weird to be on the boardwalk by myself. But let's get some pizza. Now this is a slice of pizza. And this is why you go here. Literally every time. We got we got a view of the ocean. I'm feeling it. They're they're reseeding the dunes, which always makes me smile. And we got a good view of the pier too, which isn't open yet. Not just yet. There's some stuff open. A lot of the spin and win games, a lot of the uh a lot of these guys over here are open, but not so much the amusements just yet. Maybe I'll have to come back for those, but right now I'm gonna eat my pizza. Pizza. Whoops. Mm. Mm. Oh yeah. There is something just so very special and unique about the Jersey Shore. Like, I don't know. I don't even know how to describe it. I just. I live here. I love it. It's just, it reinvigorates. <sighs> so I think that's going to be it. I might take one last ride without the videos just to kind of savor everything. But thanks for coming with me, guys. I'm sorry this one wasn't on a uh, happier note. I will say happier note. Look at that green thing. I'm going to have to ride that. Let me lay in. Come on, zoom in, zoom in. Oh, yeah. I'm going I'm going to blur that out, apparently. Come on. Focus. Whatever. Don't matter. There we go. I'm going to have to ride that eventually. So, this is not the last you will see of Seaside Heights. Take care, everybody. And I'll see you in the next video. Later.